Welcome to this tutorial on TIPCO LogLogic LMI regular expression searches. Let's say you have some data on a server and you have collected and sent this data to the LMI. How do you search for the necessary data using targeted criteria? For example, if this is a log that you want to search for, LMI lets you use regular expressions to target your searches. You can use a general expression to match the entire log content as follows. This expression matches all of the text and the numeric string following the colon. Or, you can use a refined regular expression to match specific strings within the log. For example, an expression to match a numeric string is highlighted in red, or one that matches a specific word, such as foobar. Let's suppose you have some data on a Windows machine. In this case, we are using demo data from Fubar Company to perform our searches against. We used LogLogic Universal Collector to collect and send this data to LMI. As you can see, the numbers indicate the logs are now collected and sent to the LMI. Once you log into the LMI, go to the Dashboard's Log Source Status page. Look for the IP address of the Windows device from which you collected and sent the data over. Values in the 1, 5, and 15 minute columns indicate the data has arrived on the LMI. Click the Search tab. LMI offers three different search methods, Index Search, Regular Expression Search, and Advanced Search. This tutorial focuses on Regex Search, so click on the Regular Expression Search. On the Regex Search Filter tab, click the drop-down arrow next to the device type. Choose Microsoft Windows. That narrows down the IPs belonging to that device type. Next, under Source Device, choose the IP address of your device. Under Search Filter, you can choose to retrieve all logs, use a predefined filter, keywords or exact phrase, or a regular expression pattern match. Let's choose Retrieve All. Next, we will choose the time interval for the search. You can choose hourly time periods, daily, or a specific time period. In this case, we'll choose the last hour. You can run your search immediately or schedule it to run at a later date and time. For now, let's run immediately. You can give the search a name, if desired, so that you can run this search again. Then, once you've uh, finished with the name, click the Run key. The search moves to the Pending Searches tab, where we can see its progress. Once completed, the search moves to the Finished Searches tab, which summarizes the report time, the search time span, and other criteria, and the report size, and download options, including CSV, PDF, and HTML formats. Choose HTML. The report shows what sources you ran the search against, the filter you used, and what time frame the search was executed against. It also shows the name of the search and the IP address of the LMI that it was run on. Now, as you can see, there are several other logs in addition to the demo logs we collected. Let's narrow our search to those logs that contain the phrase random application. Go back to the regex search filter tab and enter the phrase random application in the use exact phrase box. Run the search and when completed, note that the results are narrowed down to 100 logs view as HTML. As you can see, the results set includes only logs that contain the pattern match random application. Going back to the original unfiltered search, let's focus on this pattern here. We will construct a regular expression that includes the literal string for the event ID 4620 with a regex pattern match for the rest of the message. Go back to the regex search tab and choose the regular expression option. Type the regex pattern as follows. Run the search. 
When it completes, notice that there is just one matching log. Open the report as HTML. As you can see, the log message matches the regex pattern. You can use complex patterns to match an entire log or refined patterns like this one to narrow your search result set. This marks the end of this tutorial. Please go to the following links to learn more about TIBCO LogLogic.